highly requested video. I've had a ton of people ask me to do this tag video and it is the 10 baby names that you love but you won't be using video tag. As you can see in here, and I'm going to talk about this in my next pregnancy update, but we've been doing a lot of um, moving around so we have the crib set up and stuff so that's why it looks a little different here obviously between Chris and I we have seven children which means we've had seven opportunities between the two of us to pick names that we like and use them for our children's names so honestly to come up with ten more names that I really liked it wasn't hard but I, I can definitely say that some of these I probably wouldn't actually use for my children just because I love the name they're not necessarily ones that I would have actually picked for my babies I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna switch off boy and girl and since we have so many boys I guess I'll just start with the boy name so the first name that I absolutely love this name was our runner-up for the name for this baby if it happened to be a boy I fell in love with this name we were dead set on this name we actually had this name like set in stone and then something changed and we just thought it wasn't the right name for this baby and we liked it. the boy name that we picked out for this baby we just ended up liking it better than this name so this one was definitely one that i love and that i still love and the name is easton i can see an easton as a baby and a toddler and an adult and i just love the name so much and if I ever had another boy, which I'm definitely not having any more kids, but if I ever did, this one would be probably my number one pick. So the next name is going to be a girl name, and this name was actually going to be Kyson's name if he was a girl. So this name might sound familiar because we did have this name picked out for if Kyson was a girl, and the name is McKenna. And I just think that this is such a beautiful name, and I've really liked this name forever. I can't remember ever not liking it. I remember naming some of my dolls McKenna. Just such a beautiful name, which is the reason why I had it picked out for if one of the twins was a girl. The next boy name is Oliver. And this, again, this was the third runner up for the boy name for us, for this baby. I wanted Oliver so bad. The only reason why we didn't pick it is because it's so extremely common. Every time I see that name, I'm just like, oh, it's such a gorgeous name. It's such a beautiful baby boy name and I am just madly in love with it. The next name for a little girl that I love is the name that we had picked out for Caden if he was a girl. So if Caden was a girl he would have been named Annabelle and I just think that that is such a beautiful name. The fact that it's kind of like two names put together I don't know what it is about it but it just like flows off the tongue and it's just so like elegant and beautiful sounding. There's various different ways to spell it but overall I just think Annabelle is such a beautiful name. The next boy name that I absolutely love is Logan and obviously I would not name any of my children this name only because Lilia's stepbrother's name is Logan. I have loved that name forever. I actually considered it when I was pregnant with Landon. Logan is one that I absolutely love because I wanted to stick with the L theme. I just ended up loving Landon a little bit more than Logan but still the name to this day I just love that name for little boys. The next girl name that I absolutely love this is kind of gonna be a two-in-one because they're very similar and I love them both but I didn't want to have them they're like too similar to have for different names but I love the name Emma and I love the name Ella overall I just love like the short sweet like E names I don't know if that makes any sense but like it just flows so nicely both of those are such beautiful names and Lilia has a little friend named Emma so I probably never would have actually used that Ella is definitely one that I probably would have considered um, if I was having more children the next boy name is is a pretty popular one as well. When I originally heard it, I didn't fall in love with it right away, but over the years, hearing it again and again and again, it's definitely one that I would consider, and that's Liam. It's short for William. My brother's middle name is actually William, and that's what it always reminded me of, but as I've gotten older, the name has really grown on me to the point where I would probably actually use it, and I'm pretty sure I suggested it as a boy name for this baby. I just think Liam is such a handsome name for a little boy. Next little girl name that I fell in love with the minute that I heard it is Everly. A friend of mine just had a little girl and she named her Everly and I have never heard that name before and when I saw that I was like, oh my gosh, that is beautiful. <laughs> I've never heard that name before. It's obviously not a very popular name, but I just think that that is absolutely gorgeous and it goes along with the other girl names that I was talking about like the Ella and the Emma. I just love that flow that it has and Everly is just beautiful. Such a beautiful name. The last little boy name is one that I was sure I was going to name my little boy. If you asked me back in like 
high school if I ever wanted a boy and what his name would be. This one is probably my favorite and the one that I would be most likely to consider um, at my age now that I still love from when I was younger. And the name is Carson. And I just think that that's such a handsome name. Because I have Kyson and Kaden, Carson is like too much so I would actually never use it for my children but I regardless I absolutely love that name and I think that it fits little boys perfectly the last name that I absolutely love but won't be using because we're not having any more kids is Kinsley there was a little girl in the twins preschool class whose name was Kinsley and she was the cutest dang thing I have ever seen <laughs> don't you hate it how like You'll love a baby name, but you know someone who has that name and it just like ruins it for you. Well, this was like the opposite. I don't think I ever would have considered the name Kinsley, but this little girl just made that name for me. And since then, I think I've heard it a couple times. Around here, it's not very common, I don't think. Sounds like it might be more like of a Southern name, but I just think that it is the cutest little Southern Belle name ever. Kyson, Kaden, and Kinsley would probably be too much, but if I had triplets, I cannot say that I wouldn't have used that. <laughs> so that is it for this tag video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. There are so many beautiful names out there. I was just like scrolling through all the baby names and I was like, oh, that's cute. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's cute. These are names that I've actually either truly considered for naming my babies or just really fell in love with over the years. In the comments below, I wanna hear from you guys what are some names that you guys love, some baby names that you love, but you won't be using? I love just looking at baby names and talking about baby names. Naming a child is something that is so important and it's gonna stay with them forever, obviously. So I would love to hear what other people's thoughts are on these names and other names and baby names in general. So that is it for this video, guys. Make sure you follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Snapchat, and I will talk to you guys tomorrow for our next video. Bye. And we are going to determine whether or not these old wives tales are telling us that we're gonna have a boy or a girl. Okay, so these are not in any particular order.